George, just talking to everybody about just getting off the plane last night and, and seeing those fans, what, what does that mean to you and to play for these guys just in, in general all season long? Yeah, I mean, you kind of get off the plane with the thought of like, man, like this, is, this was a great season, but it ended and you kind of have like that down feeling and then you're getting into your car and you just hear like these roar of cheers and then you're like, oh, there's some people over there and then you realize it's literally like a parade. There's like a sea of fans and I think it just goes to speak on how great this community is and how much they support us. You don't find this everywhere, and I'll be the first to tell you that. Um, for us to run out of the tunnel every night at home and to have a packed house every night, uh, that's something we'll never take for granted but always cherish. So I think uh, being a part of this community, being a part of this organization is something special to all of us, and we really appreciate the fan support. It's, it's second to none for sure. Disappointing end, any, any loss is obviously, but uh, personally, just for you, how, how would you kind of grade out this, this season? Yeah, I think this year was huge for my growth. Um, you know, obviously on and off the court, but more speaking about on the court, just being able to contribute in, in meaningful minutes and get out there and help, help the team to victories, um, knowing my role and just becoming better in that uh, as the year got on. Uh, I think that was huge for me and with developing trust uh, with this organization and the coaches. And uh, I was obviously real excited that I got opportunities to show what I can do. And, I want to continue to improve and go into the summer, and I just have a lot of motivation to come back and be better. Yeah, what, is, what does the summer look like for you? Uh, summer looks pretty busy. You know, obviously, I'm going to try to be around as much as possible to continue to get work and develop here. And obviously, when I'm not here, I'm going to be doing the same, working on my body and working on being as versatile as possible. I think that's the biggest key in this game is if you can play multiple positions, you can play for longer stretches. Yeah, um, just the the camaraderie of this team, Hank, how would you kind of describe that for people on the outside? Um, I, don't, I don't think I could put uh, the right words uh, behind it, but I don't think people will ever understand how close we really were. Um, I've been on teams before where, you know, they say they're the closest, but this team is really the closest team that, you know, I've ever been on, um, even through college and high school. I just think everybody really genuinely cared about the other person. Um, and that's tough to find in professional sports. Um, whether if it was picking someone up when they were down or going to one of their kids' birthday parties, I feel like we were always together, always laughing, always had jokes. And I think that's special in this league. And I think this organization really values that and sees that. And whatever happens this off season, I know I'm going to hold a, a special place in my heart for this team because all the guys have made this season so special and the memories that we've built will, will last a lifetime. You know, it's, it's soon, but is, are there plays or games or moments that, that already stand out to you in your mind as sort of the, the positives you'll take into the summer? Yeah, uh, you know, obviously you, the last memory, obviously down in Houston losing, I think that's gonna be one that probably pushes you through an extra couple sprints on the treadmill in the summer. But uh, there's a ton of great moments that we've had. You know, I was just talking downstairs about the one uh, where we had a bunch of guys go down before we played the Lakers and we had a bunch of bench guys, you know, rally and, and help us win. And uh, I just remember walking in the back and having uh, all the guys that were injured cheering us on and being so happy for us. And that's what it's all about. And I think the veteran guys in this group and even they're sprinkling down to the young guys, they get that, you know, it's all about being genuinely happy for other, other people while pursuing the goal of winning. And I think we do a great job of that and I'm just excited for the future of this group. As an individual play, I think that the one that stands out for me is like your block against the Clippers. Ooh, man, I revved my engine on that one. LA, LA saw a Ferrari on the court that night. No, um, no, that was good. I, I, I actually, the cool thing about that, we can actually talk about team camaraderie is that was a huge moment, you know, in my career, you know, obviously I'm not known as a defensive stopper. So for me to sprint the length of the court and make that happen was I was excited about it, that whole moment. And I just think it, it speaks volumes to this team because the next day in my locker, I had a huge canvas. It was, I don't know measurements, but it was big. And uh, it was a gift from Joe. It was a picture of me uh, blocking the, that shot so I could hang it up and remember how uh, solid I was defensively that game. And that just goes to show like these guys actually care. Like it's bigger than basketball. They actually care about who you are as a person and how you're feeling on a day-to-day -day basis. And I, I, couldn't be more thankful to be part of this organization.